The world was introduced to Brielle Bierman on Real Housewives of Atlanta when she was just a preteen. She was thrust into the limelight to live out her awkward teenage years while the world got to watch her literally grow up on TV. Here's the stunning transformation of Brielle Bierman. Bierman wouldn't be where she is today if it wasn't for her wise-cracking, no-nonsense mother, Kim Zolciak Bierman. The feisty blonde bombshell had Bierman when she was just 18 years old and raised her as a single parent. The proud mom shared a throwback Instagram post on her daughter's 21st birthday, gushing about how excited and nervous she had been to welcome Brielle into the world. She called Brielle, My sidekick, my heart, my strength, my pride and joy, my best friend. The mother-daughter duo look more like sisters these days, and Brielle has boasted about how she can confide in her mother like a sister or friend. I also think a lot of parents aren't as accepting as you are. Like, I know, like, some of my friends can't go to their mom and be like, oh my god, like, ball, you know, like, talk yeah. about certain things. As Don't Be Tardy viewers would know, Brielle didn't exactly focus on studying throughout high school. It's like five days a month. Oh my god, that's 30 days a year. But did I do that right? No. no. Instead, audiences saw the boy-crazed teen focus more on her social life. Along with an apparent lack of interest, Brielle was bullied in school because of her mother's televised personal life. In a 2013 interview with Glamour, Kim detailed how quickly her personal business hits the press and spoke about her struggle to protect her kids from the critics on social media. She shared, My kids are obviously in the public eye and they have social media. With my mom bashing me, it put my family in a bad place, and Brielle, people in school say stuff to her. Brielle even opened up on Twitter about being bullied and beat up in high school. Thankfully, she was able to overcome the difficult times and get her high school diploma in 2015. You want to have our family meeting right now? What family meeting? Everybody's here. Yeah, we have a family meeting that we're calling. Brielle originally had her mom's last name, Zolciak, and she spent most of her life being raised by a single parent. However, that all changed as soon as NFL player Croy Bierman came into her mother's life. Croy married Brielle's mom in 2011, and soon after, he adopted Brielle and her sister, Ariana, who both took on his last name. Croy would become the father Brielle never had and often became the person to challenge her choices. Despite being a bit of a disciplinarian, Brielle had displayed immense respect and love for her adoptive dad. She opened up about her feelings for Croy in an Instagram post, writing in part, It takes a strong man to immediately step up to the plate and take the role of dad at 23 years old, but you did, and I'm so glad you did. Every day I wonder how we lived our lives without you. I love you, Papa. Along with being extremely close to her mom, Brielle has an inseparable bond with her younger sister, Ariana Bierman. While the pair has been seen on TV bickering, the girls have always supported and uplifted one another throughout the years. Brielle has expressed her gratitude toward her sister on social media, including an October 2018 Instagram post captioned in part, I'm so honored and thankful you're my little sister. From stabbing you with a spork to snuggling every night, we've come a long way together, and I wouldn't want to do life with anyone else. You're my most special friend, and today you deserve to be treated like the princess you are. While things have changed a lot since their mom married Croy, expanding their brood to a total of six kids, one thing has remained the same for Brielle and her sister, their undying love for each other. Growing up on television can afford someone many opportunities, like the chance to live out one of your dreams. In season four episode of Don't Be Tardy, Brielle expressed her desire to pursue a career in broadcasting with the intent to become an on-air personality like her idol, E! News host Juliana Rancic. After pulling some strings and reaching out to some of her contacts, Mama Kim landed Bierman an amazing opportunity to audition at E! News. Have you done a lot of this before? No, I've never read off the teleprompter. Is that G over there? How are you, honey? No cry, you are so sweet. During the episode, Brielle breaks down into tears while meeting Rancic, who encourages the reality star to be confident and persistent with her dreams. While Bierman still hasn't made the jump to TV hosting full-time, it's safe to say that the girl is a natural when it comes to being on screen. With cyberbullies eager to attack every imperfection, no one would blame Brielle if she chose to refrain from showing off her body online. Thankfully, she's never let the haters destroy her body confidence or warp her thoughts on eating. Whether she's dressed in body-hugging jeans or in a barely-there bikini, Brielle is always praising her own body and expressing her sexuality without shame. Additionally, the star doesn't restrict her eating habits to obtain an unrealistic, quote, Hollywood body. And while she doesn't shy away from posting bikini pics or showing off her cleavage, Brielle made sure to warn her Instagram fans about the dangers of social media, writing, Social media can seriously harm your mental health. Stop comparing yourself to a lot of these unrealistic illusions that people create to make you think their life is perfect. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. 
Brielle's relationship with Chicago White Sox pitcher Michael Kopech played out for fans of Don't Be Tardy for the course of the couple's two-year relationship. The lovebirds were inseparable, and the relationship was serious enough for the pair to consider moving in together. Sadly, the couple split in March 2018. She talked about the breakup in a February 2019 interview with 2Fab, where she detailed how the baseball player wanted her to wait for him while they were on a break. However, Brielle stood up for herself and said no. She went on to explain that although their split was painful for her, she's in a much better headspace now. The reality star had to experience the pain on camera, which was hard for her. She told Hollywood Life in a February 2019 interview, Last season, there were a lot of crazy things going on. I was really bummed out about it at first, but I got over it easily. I'm trying to find out who I want to be. Brielle has changed a lot since she first appeared on Real Housewives of Atlanta as a preteen, and in 2016, the blonde beauty made a big change to her face. She got lip injections. Brielle has been honest about having her lips plumped, and Kim expressed her support for her daughter in a May 2016 interview with Us Weekly, explaining, She bothered me for five years about her lips. She was like, I hate my lips, I hate my lips, so I'm like, then go fix them. You only go around this planet once. If it makes her happy, so be it. Despite only changing her lips, Brielle received hate for having other plastic surgery done to her face and body. The reality star has adamantly denied having any additional cosmetic procedures, and she addressed plastic surgery rumors in a November 2016 interview on The Doctors. They all gotten... tell me that I've like ruined my face. Like They had think I've had surgery. all this work done to my face, and when in reality, all I've done is my lips. Online trolls attack Brielle over just about everything she does in her life, including not having a, quote, real job. Although the young television star has never worked a regular 9-to-5 workday, she does work hard for her money. Kim defended her daughter in a May 2017 interview with Andy Cohen on Watch What Happens Live, explaining that her daughter makes close to six figures through social media. Brielle's massive social media platform, which includes over 1 million followers on Instagram and over 245,000 followers on Twitter as of April 2019, has helped her obtain a lucrative career as a social media influencer. There really is no key to getting people to follow you on Instagram. I mean, when you look this good, you don't need it. Please stop. The reality star has an established fan base and a strong online presence that has garnered her opportunities to work with brands like 310 Nutrition, FabFitFun, and Loving Tan, to name a few. While Brielle spent most of her life living comfortably and rent-free with her family, she hit a major milestone in 2018. She moved out. The reality star gushed about her gorgeous Atlanta condo on Snapchat, and she also confirmed her move in an Instagram post where she shared the sexy art piece her mom bought for her new place. Brielle previously expressed a desire to move out on her own and become more independent in a December 2017 interview with 2Fab. Her original plan was to move out at age 21 to live alone for a year, before settling down with then-boyfriend Mike Kopech. She explained, I don't ever want to have to depend on a man, so I want to learn to do things on my own and support myself before I go from living in my parents' house to living with a man. Although the couple split, the breakup didn't alter her plans to experience life in her own place. Growing up on TV and facing constant criticism on social media has given Brielle a thick skin against haters. The reality star doesn't take crap from online bullies, and she certainly doesn't allow people to bully the people she loves. When Kim appeared on The Real Housewives of Atlanta Season 10 reunion, she felt personally attacked by the rest of her co-stars. After watching the ordeal on TV, Brielle took to Twitter to unleash her anger. This wasn't the first time the bold beauty has spoken up for her mom. Brielle has defended their close relationship countless times, including her December 2017 interview with 2Fab where she explained, People see my relationship with my mom as too friendly, but I don't think you could ever be too friendly with your parents. I think some parents aren't close enough with their kids, and communication is key in my family. On February 13, 2019, Brielle, Kim, and Ariana launched Cab Cosmetics, a cruelty-free makeup line featuring vibrant lip kits. On the company website, the ladies wrote, We are so excited that Cab is finally here. We have put our hearts into this for so long and couldn't be happier to share this with all of you. Cab features 10 lip shades to choose from and displays the words, People will stare, make it worth their while across the packaging. The ladies have all shared sneak peeks of their beauty line leading up to its launch, including one Instagram photo of Brielle wearing Funfetti liner and bullet lipstick. The Beerman ladies have also hinted that blush is next in the beauty line. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite stuff are coming soon! Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one!